All right, you guys, today I've got a special treat. Not only am I gonna introduce you to one of our dear friends, but also someone who, in my opinion, is an ama amazing artist. She's here to talk about just that, some of her amazing art. You're in for a treat. I'm proud to introduce to you Janelle Peterson. Hi there, I'm Janelle Peterson, and I uh, wanted to share with you a little bit my wood burning art that I've been recently gotten into. Um, I've just been wood burning for a few months, and I just kind of got into it. My dad had recently built us a Murphy bed out of blue pine, and we had all this scrap piece of wood, and I just, it was too beautiful to throw away, and I felt like I needed to do something with it. So I started wood burning some designs and working the knots into the design and just using the coloration and the natural beauty of the wood. And um, so I've, it's been really fun and therapeutic. And Sandy uh, and Kevin have commented on some of the, my pictures I've been posting on Facebook. And so Sandy and I got, have been secretly together working on a design and um, she wanted to give Kevin a piece for their anniversary, as you saw. So um, yeah, so we'll uh, go show you a few more pieces. So uh, you can see here, this is kind of the, the wood that I use. This is the blue pine. And uh, I've also, so it can come in lots of variations. It can be really rotted out. It can be pretty clean and smooth. Um, and what we have here is juniper. And this is gonna be something I'm waiting for it to dry out. Right now it's still very green. I picked it um, out at the Ocho Coes in Central Oregon. And this particular piece is a tree that's over 200 years old. Um, and, sorry. And I got all these other juniper rounds that just waiting for them to dry and I will run them through the planer and smooth them out and then I'll start some new designs. And here is my little tool that does all the designs. And like <laughs> wood burning. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And my I just collect um, this is a really large piece of blue pine and I'll just cut it down to size and usually I like to work around these knots here and incorporate those into the design. So the process, I, this just heats up, takes about three minutes for it to get hot, and I gently outline my design with just a light pencil mark and uh, just as a guide, and then I just trace it. And sometimes the wood grain kind of leads me in a different direction, so I gotta just go with it and not be too particular on uh, a design. Um, here is the very first piece that I practiced on, just a, a scrap piece of billet that my husband brought home and just just practiced. And that is all there is to it. All right, so if you are you like what you see, um, click here and that will send you to a link to more work. And if you want to see more, then keep watching. <laughs>